Hi, I'm Honda Pro Jason. Welcome to the Honda Pro Show. Watched by millions worldwide and kept alive because you subscribe. This week we have an outstanding show, so let's get into it. Welcome to this week's edition of the Honda Pro Show. I'm Honda Pro Jason, and with me as always is my cameraman, Matt. Hello, everyone. Hey, Matt. I have been extremely busy flying coast to coast. I was out in New York for the New York Auto Show. I was also out there to visit my friends at Mohawk Honda. And then from New York, I went all the way out to LA where Honda unveiled a shoe. Yeah, I said a shoe, a driving shoe. This is cool. Thrillist and Jack Threads got together with Honda and they invited me out for the first time to view this new shoe that they did. It's pretty cool, let me tell you. They had this big extravaganza, they had food, a DJ, a pianist, it was cool, and they unveiled the shoe, which, by the way, I ordered a pair and I'll be getting them. Really cool looking. If you open up the flap underneath the laces, it says Civic, and it was actually inspired by the 10th generation Civic. I got to meet the designer, meet a bunch of new PR people from Honda. It was really an epic, epic night. And as soon as I get the shoe, I will be showcasing them for the first time on this show. Have you ever wanted to import one of the really cool cars from Japan or the UK, but you live in the US and you have to wait 25 years? Well, if you're a museum, you don't have to wait 25 years. Let me explain. Recently, the Honda S660, which is a little key car built in Japan, mid-engine, convertible, turbo, was spotted running around Tennessee. And my Facebook page and my Twitter blew up. Everyone wanted to know where this car came from. Well, I did a little digging. And it looks like Lane Motor Museum out in Tennessee imported the car for their museum. And what's cool is I talked to the director over there, and they don't just have this car. They also have an N1 and a couple of Honda Beats. So in a conversation, I asked if I could come out and film them. He said, OK. And there's also a chance of driving one. So I'm going to keep you guys informed of this goes on. But hopefully very soon I'll go out there and I'll be filming and bringing all this information to you. Love it or hate it, the new 10th generation Civic is a monster hit in sales. Breaking an all-time March record, selling 32,855 cars. The next step on Honda's next milestone tour for the 10th gen Civic is going to be Washington DC. They started in LA, they went to Houston, and now it's Washington's turn. It's going to be April 16th, Saturday. All the information is underneath in the link below. Keep in mind that this is a free show. They'll have food, they'll have entertainment, and if I know Honda, they'll also have some giveaways. Is Acura getting their own version of the HRV? Is it going to be built in China, distributed around the world, including the US? Well, according to Left Lane News, it's going to be called the Acura CDX. How cool is that going to be? It's going to be just underneath the RDX and Acura should be making an official announcement on this new car very soon. Honda works with many different companies to develop new products. Most recently, they've worked with Hitachi to develop a new portable breathalyzer that can be installed in your car, and actually, if it detects alcohol in your breath, it wouldn't even let the car start. That's gonna be quite interesting. So my question to you is, is this an invasion of your privacy? Or is this another way that Honda's actually saving more lives? So in the comments below, let me know, would you want a portable breathalyzer installed in your own car? How about your kid's car? How about your neighbor's car? It's time for some rumors. The next generation CRV is rumored to have a seven passenger option and hybrid all wheel drive capability. How cool is that gonna be? It's fun fact time. Every body style of the 10th generation Civic will have the availability of a six-speed manual transmission along with a turbocharged engine. And that's your fun fact of the week. Thank you guys so much for watching this week's edition of the Honda Pro Show. Many of you have asked about my upcoming world tour. It's gonna to be starting in Chicago, going to Malaysia, the UK, and down to the Netherlands. I'll have more information on that coming very soon. Now for the giveaway. I have for you guys stickers. Stickers, everyone loves stickers. I'm gonna have in the nose stickers and don't hate stickers. 
I'm gonna give five lucky winners each of these stickers and your choice of colors. All you guys have to do is tell me in the comments below where you're gonna stick it. Again, I hope you guys all enjoyed this show. And as always, I'm the Honda Pro, and now you're in the know.